What's up guys? My name is Yoshi Nirajumi. I'm here with Doug Desitals and he did a little poll on a Q&A on his social media for you guys and we're gonna pull up some questions so um, he can answer them for you. All right, Doug, the first question that I have here is Oliver Men Menard. And again, I apologize if I slay anybody's last names <laughs> or, or whatever, it I happens. apologize, I apologize. It does happen quite a lot too. I know about it. You do know about it, don't you? Um, Oliver Menard says, most iconic skate spot. Iconic skate, Love Park. I think that's for me. I've grown up watching Love Park all the time. Steve Williams and uh, Josh Kaler is killing it. Zach Drost mentioned, how did you and Yoshi meet? That's, that's a good, good question. That is a good question. That's a good question. And uh, we met back in junior high, and he was always skating in the parking lot, and I see him skating. I started skating with him, and then we became friends. And uh, he taught me how to no slide, and the rest is history. Yeah, and you are the king of no slide, flip in, flip out shits now, dude. It's amazing. <laughs> Brandon Westfer, worst injury skateboarding. Rolled ankles are the worst. Like I've, I've had broken bones, but nothing holds. You know. Would you break? Well, I've broken my wrist. My foot and my middle finger. And out of those breaks, what were the worst ones? The wrist. Wrist? Yeah. Matthew Hines says, what's been your favorite moment since being on the Revive team? Let's see, I've, I've got a few moments. We went to Love Park and that was pretty epic. And just recently they put me pro and that's always gonna be a memory. I'll never forget that. So that's, that's up there. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm reading these and some of these are really... All right, this is corny. Chris. Buchanan, or Buchanan, whatever, the, uh, sorry Chris, who has the worst farts on the Revive slash Force crew? That's a good question. <laughs> I'm gonna go straight up with you, dude. I've, I've... You know what, that's my answer too. <laughs> really? Either, either so it. It's gotta be me. <laughs> All right, Tucker Forbes says, what's your fav favorite obstacle to skate? Man, that's tough. I like, I like what I'm skating in front of me, but I do enjoy ledges and manual pads a lot. Flat bars too. Occasionally set of stairs and a hubba. Okay, Mark Akarki. Dude, I even know this guy and I can't even say his last name. <laughs> Sorry, Mark um, Akarki. My bad. If you had one whole day to skate with any iconic skateboard legend, no matter what point in time, from Tony Alva to Nottis to Eric Costin, who would it be? I'm gonna go with Kane Milton and Tim Broch, both of them together Ooh. skating. That's a fun. good choice. That's a good choice. Rest be the ball to him. Matthew Hines asks, what's your plans for the future of Amp Grip? Uh, just keep going, getting it bigger, get some more grip going, maybe new logos, and uh, just promote it more. Get a bigger team. I did notice your grip is actually really good. <laughs> and I also like how you have the cutout of your logo. So you could actually do, what you, like you've been doing these, uh, these contests, right, to, to do the art, like you put well, yeah, whatever. Yeah, the art. Yeah, yeah, so that's basically, uh, that, that's something new. I've, I've, I haven't seen anyone else do that. It's something fun, and that way you put your personality on your board. Yeah, exactly, dude, I love that, that's rad. Damned Lifer 123 asks, who do you look up to when you're skating? Growing up, I've always looked up to Ronnie Krieger and, and Jimmy Ray, and I still do till, till this day. Joshua Tay asks, pancakes or waffles? French toast. Nice. <laughs> Ian Anderson asks, any new skate goals? Just work on new footage, get a new part going, and get more footage. I guess I said that twice, but it's important. <laughs> Perpetually Sanity asks, do you find Andy Shirok and Sam Tabor weird? Of course, that's, that's having fun. That, if they weren't weird, it'd be boring. Michelle Torres asks, Best pair of skate shoes you've ever had. I know this. Costin ones on ES, hands down. Ne next to that with the ES Excel. Jackson Wish asked, "How did you meet Andy Schrock?" I met him on well through Facebook and Shredcast, and then we started skating together, and then it just happened. We became, became friends, and I started riding for them. Mister Sir asked, "Favorite video game?" Gun Auto, hands down, is one of the best games I've ever played. And then I'm also going to toss in a, The Last of Us and Street Fighter, because it's a fighting game. And one more is going to be uh, Fallout 3. Uh, Girl Skater 7 asks, can you sprinkle some of your skills onto me? 
I don't, I don't know. What? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, MC Squared. I wonder if he's a rapper or some shit. MC right, or, or in the math. Ooh, that's... That is math. Wow, I didn't even get that. I'm Asian. <laughs> um, have you ever wanted to quit skating? Every day. <laughs> but we all have bad days. <clears throat> we gotta have fun, but sometimes, sometimes you're, like, you're just over it. It's a love-hate relationship. But in the end of the day, I'm never gonna quit. I love it. It's who I am. Doug White says, top three tricks. Kick flip, tray flip, front of the flip. Seth to land 17 says, still killing the cookie crisp. I ran out. Now I'm on Fruity Pebbles. Ooh, Fruity Pebbles is pretty bomb. OG Skater asks, what kind of music do you like? I like everything besides, you know, dubstep and country. But I'm, I'm down for rock, metal, uh, rap, hip hop, Wu Tang, all that stuff. Wu Tang, Wu Tang, I came to bring the pain. Ellie Rhodes asks, do you have any hobbies outside of skateboarding? Outside of skateboarding, you know, video games, snowboarding, driving, working on my car, traveling, and taking photos and video. Jake987 asks, what got you into skateboarding? Skateboarding did. <laughs> KDemat2 asks, will you ever do a day in your life? I mean, I've, I've done a few already, and I already filmed two more. I filmed one in Texas and one in, uh, in Ohio, and they're coming soon. But yeah, they're on my channel already, so just look for them. Blake T. <laughs> asks, what would win in a fight, taco or grilled cheese? Considering I don't like Mexican food, grilled cheese. Wow. Kyle Tillery 12 asks, what is the hardest trick you can do? Flat ground heel flip. Hardest thing ever. All right, Tape Back the Streets asks, how long have you been on Revive? I've been on Revive about a year and four months, I think, about. Christian Dubon asked, what is your favorite video part of all times? Plan B, Second of Smoke, Jimmy Ray. Ooh. Uh, Street Skater 101 asks, what would, you, what would your career be if skateboarding did not exist in your life? I'd probably be working in video game industry or busboy somewhere. Miles Alvarez asks, if you could go to any spot, where would it be? Not so much a spot, but I want to go back to Barcelona, Spain. It's amazing. It's like a dream come true. It's like skating in dreams. It's that good. Yeah. You can't look at your phone. Oh, sorry. You have to straight forward camera. <laughs> well, that's my q and I hope you liked it. If you want to see more, click the like button below. Coming soon, we're going to do Q&A with this guy. Yoshi Nerd Jumi. So, uh, get some questions right for him. Peace. It better be good questions.